In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem called factoring out a binomial from a polynomial greatest common factor factoring basic. We're asked to rewrite the expression by factoring out a w minus 7. So first we look at the expression and we can see that both the first term has a w minus 7 and the second term also has a w minus 7 and that's going to allow us to factor out the w minus 7. So to write that I'm going to start with the w minus 7 that I am factoring out and in order to see what's left I'm going to put the remaining terms inside the parentheses. I first look at the leading term which was 6w times w minus 7 and if I'm factoring out the w minus 7, then that means I am dividing out the w minus 7. And doing so means that those w minus 7s cancel. So I would be left with 6w in the first term. Again, I have factored out the w minus 7. And then in the second term, I have plus a w minus 7, well what happens if I factor out the w minus 7? Just as before, I'm going to start with what I have inside, which is the w minus 7, and then I'm going to write underneath that the term that I'm factoring out, which is w minus 7. And when we have both the numerator and the denominator exactly the same, they cancel, but keep in mind that they cancel to 1. An example of this would be 4 divided by 4. 4 divided by 4, the 4's cancel and we get 1. It's important that we don't lose that 1 in the process. So 1 is what we have left. Just to sort of check our answer here, w minus 7 is being multiplied by 6w, which is the original first term that we started with. That's 6w times w minus 7. But not only is this factor being multiplied by the first term, it's also being multiplied by the second term. And a 1 times w minus 7 is going to give us that second term, w minus 7. So checking with multiplication, I can see that we have successfully factored out the w minus 7. We're left with a 6w in the first term and the plus 1 in the second term, sort of a placeholder and that is our factored polynomial.